Hello friends, in this video we are still playing gym. We will not play uh, manipulation on the photo, but we will play text effect. This is because I'm tired of playing photo manipulation. Finally, I play text only. Maybe if I get tired of playing text effect in gym, I am planning on converting PSD mockup in gym. Actually, I have long wanted to make this effect. Uh, sorry, this text text effect. That is, uh, we will create a grass text effect in gym. Let's see the final design here. Like this. At first, I thought it was pretty easy to make this text effect. Obstacles I experienced at the time, just a matter of grass that is on the edge of the text object. But now I can handle it with a brush. I use a lot of grass brushes that is uh, ultimate grass you can get it in deviant art i have included a link in the video description here we will not learn to make the text with grass effect but we will learn to make a suitable background and a solid texture and make a shadow so the result look realistic before opening opening gym make sure you have installed ultimate brush in gym Okay, open your gym. Here we are. We open a new image. Hit, click file new. Here for width, I give it number uh, one thousand three hundred. Uh, sixty-six, and height, I give with number uh, seven hundred sixty-eight. Click OK. Here I rename the layer with the name um, gradient um, PG. And next we will give uh, the foreground color and background color. For foreground, for foreground, we give it a light green color. Light green color. Okay, and for background we give a dark green color. Okay, and then click uh, blend tool, and this section. Select a radial and give gradient color by dragging from this point up to this point. Okay. Here I will uh, open the paper texture image. Hmm, sorry. We click file, open as layers. Um. Chrome paper. Okay, I rename this layer with the name of uh, Chrome paper and rotate with layer, transform and select rotate 90 degrees clockwise and scale with scale tool and scale like this. Okay, and then click scale. And then change to black and white with click uh, colors. To saturate. Select a fabric and click OK. Change the layer mode to soft light. To sharpen the result, choose colors levels here i tap with number uh, 30 and then click ok create a new layer here we give it number 
here we give uh, the name uh, white and choose white click ok and then we make text here click text tool and create a text area here I use uh, I use phone, uh, for phone I use um, Oswald Paul for phone size is 260 and give a uh, black color and letter spacing is 8 here I type uh, the text Jim okay. here we will change the text to make right click and click discard text information so this layer will not be editable text next we set this text to be gender auto crop layer first layer auto crop layer and then click alignment tool click this area this white area press and hold the shift key and click this text object for relative to we select first item and then click this icon and this icon to make center okay we return the layer size to the images we select layer layer to images okay and the next we open a grass image or photo I've included a link in the video description with click file open as a layer and open grass here I scale this image click scale and make center with alignment tool click this wet area <coughs> press and hold shift key for this grass image and make center okay okay here I um, hide this oh, I'm sorry here I rename this layer with the name Jim Crest and then hide this layer and select the, uh, Jim layer hide the wet layer okay change the gym layer to white color with colors levels I'm sorry colors core and then drag this point to the top left like this and then click OK right click the this gym layer and alpha to selection and control c to copy and move and show the cream cross layer click gym cross layer right click and select add layer max choose black and click add and then control v to paste okay right click floating selection select anchor layer hide this gym layer and show in the white layer okay then we we will create a grass detail on the edge of this text object here we will utilize the brush click pen brush pen brush I'm sorry select white for foreground 
and then here I use a uh, ultimate brush 042 042 and for process we fill with number 68 and expect ratio we fill with number um 6.8 and for angle we fill with number 48 and for dynamic session we select um, pencil shader right, right click gym grass layer and select mask to selection and then click select swing here I type in number 12 and click OK the selection is like shrinking ok open the selection editor tab and then click paint along the selection outline select stroke with a paint tool and click stroke ok click select none ok here I move to layer step Okay, duplicate the gym grass layer. Here, I rename this layer with the name uh, gym shadow. And right click this layer and choose apply layer max. Change the color to black with select colors, curve, and drag this point to um, put to the bottom right click OK and then give a blur F, uh, sorry motion blur with select filters blur Gaussian um, sorry motion blur for line section we fill with number 16 and for angle we fill with number 226 and then click OK OK move the gym shadow layer under the gym grass layer with click this icon and then hide the white layer and click uh, move tool select move the active layer and click this area I'm sorry I mean gym shadow and you can move this layer and then use the arrow on the keyboard okay for opacity give it number 80 Here we will sharpen the color of the grass and gradient BG. Click on this layer. Not, I mean main layer, not layer max. Okay. And then select colors, levels, fill with number 10, and then click OK. And click uh, gradient BG layer, select colors levels your item be number 235 then click OK okay and this take we have actually finished making grass text effect here I will add some words below it in order to snap against documents select view snap to canvas edge and click text tool and click this text area the text area Okay, for fun, I use uh, Oswald. Here yeah, I type uh, Adobe Photo Top Alternative and make center.
Okay, and move. And for layer mode, we select uh, and change the layer mode to soft light. Okay, in addition here, in addition here I create a new layer above, chrome paper layer. Click chrome paper and create a new layer. Here I give it a name. Um, Lightning and then make sure foreground color is white and background is black. Okay, select filters, distort, apply lines, and select set surroundings to background color. Click OK. And then give a blur effect with select filters, blur, Gaussian blur. Here we fill with number 400. And then click OK. And change the layer mode to soft light. And for opacity, give it number 40. Okay. Congrats, you have created a Cross text effect in gym with this tutorial you can definitely create it with other text i think that's all for this tutorial sorry if i'm wrong thanks for watching this video and see you later on the next video